What's going on guys? Tmart here and today we're going to be talking about the best equipment in Call of Duty Ghosts and I bet it's not what you're thinking. In fact, I bet you haven't even used this equipment yet because nobody really knows about it, but it's very, very effective. So what am I talking about? The Thermo Barrett Grenade, baby. So uh, we've never seen this grenade before in Call of Duty and it's described in game as a fuel air grenade that creates a large but low blast radius and weakens armor. So basically this thing, it's a tactical grenade, but it's like a weak lethal grenade. When you throw this thing and hit somebody with it, it takes their health down to around 30 to 40 damage. I'm not sure of the exact number, but but it's somewhere around there. And you may be wondering, okay, well, I mean, if this thing takes them down to 30 or 40 health, why does that matter? Like, why wouldn't I use a frag? Because that actually has a chance to kill them. Well, there's two reasons. So one is this thing complements your other explosives. It makes them very, very effective. Your grenades, Simtexes, IEDs, C4s, all that kind of thing. This is basically having the danger close perk, except in tactical grenade form. And it only takes up one perk point instead of taking four like Danger Close does. So uh, let's check out an example of this. Let's say the Simtex. So uh, if this is the enemy right here and you want to kill him with the Simtex, your Simtex has to be somewhere within this red line. It has to be at least that close to him in order to kill him. Now, if you hit this enemy with the Thermobaric Grenade and then throw a Simtex, it has to be somewhere within this yellowish orange line, which as you can see, over doubles the kill range of your Simtex. Pretty much if you get a hit marker with the Simtex, it's gonna kill him. That's how low his health is gonna be. So that is what makes this so effective. It just, it, it makes explosives so, so, so useful. It's, it's pretty much like having mini nukes in your pockets. You know, obviously it's very good in game types like Domination where you know there's gonna be a lot of enemies in one area on a flag or on some sort of objective, you know, whatever it is, and, and you can throw a thermo barrier grenade in, weaken them all, and then throw a Simtex in and it's probably going to kill them all, a frag or a C4, you know, whatever you want to use. And if it doesn't kill them all, since they're already so weak, then you can go in and they're only going to be like a one to two shot kill because they're already so weak. So, I mean, like uh, right here, I hit this guy with the thermobaric and then I run in with my SA-805 and I shoot him and it only takes two shots to kill rather than three at that range. So, it's going to reduce your shots to kill. It's going to make you kill enemies faster. And, and yeah, so you, you can really like seriously clear rooms. This is the best for domination, but it's also really good for like rush routes, you know, typically at the start of a map, you run into a lot of enemies in the same room if somebody's trying to fight over the middle of the map or something like that. Like, it's, uh, this grenade is very, 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 very effective, and, and I suggest that you guys try it out, because, like, seriously, it turns your explosives into mini nukes, and it turns your enemies into, into these weak little, like, paper enemies that don't have any armor on, and you can just shoot them one or two times, and they go down. So, uh, that, uh, that's the Thermo Bear Grenade in Call of Duty Ghost. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you check this thing out, because it's a, a, a very little-known uh, equipment in the game, but it's also very good. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. A bunch of great videos coming soon. Jumps and spots, episode one coming later today, so make sure to check back and uh, check out these other two videos on the screen if you haven't seen them yet. Thanks for watching, guys. Catch you all later. Peace out.